Yo, what up, people? Best games here. And we're back. And we're gonna run, 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 run all the way over here. Wait, I think I get psychic here. Yeah, thanks, Mr. Psychic. I was like, wait a second, I fucking know this. I did already know that, Mr. Psychic, because I've done this before. Thanks. Alright. Also, just fun fact. I like how this doesn't say gym, but it looks like a gym. Yo, champ in the making. care to fight this guy or fight these guys. Not really, no. I think this works. I'm pretty sure if I just follow the left side. Yeah, this works. I remember that shit. dislike battling, but I'm a gym leader. Piss off. I don't like battling, but I'm a gym leader. Then why the fuck are you a gym leader? Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Don't use your bullshit fucking items on me. Shit's not legal in a real battle. Fuck out of here with your venom off. No. Look, I almost got two... I almost got ten levels on you. Almost. It shocks me that I lost. But take this TM, because I'm crap. Also, I didn't give you fucking Psychic, because I don't know how... Ugh, my god. Getting out of here sucks! Help! Let me get out of here. You know what? Fuck this. Bag. Escape rope. <laughs> I'm, like, not interested. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not interested in fighting that shit just to get out. Um, Alright, so we're going to take on two gym leaders today, because, well, that's what we do. Pokemon. You fly to Viridian. Let's go stomp out Team Rocket. I mean, Giovanni. Swap. Switch. Switch. Let's go. Oh my god, the gym leader's here. Viridian's gym leader has returned. Even I don't know the leader's identity, but he's gonna be the toughest one yet. So all these guys are just sitting in a gym with the guy that they don't know as the leader, who's the leader of Team Rocket. It's kind of fucked up. It would make more sense if there was no trainers in this in this gym, and it was just Giovanni sitting there. Like thematically, it would make more sense. As I mash the buttons to get through the battle. item here? No. It's just the fucking corner. Dumb. Uh... You with all your bad ground type Pokemon, you're just weak to my Vaporeon. Funny, you have to fight that guy, and you actually have to fight the other one that I just fought, no matter what. Because of the way that they're situated on the board. Fight me. I want the free experience. Hey. 
No! Let's use a war beam. Bag. I only have. Surf. Let's go surf. You know, actually, I kind of wonder if I can actually buy moonstones in this game. I said that like two episodes ago when I got the stupid moonstone. I wonder if you totally can. Hmm. Eh, whatever. Over it. Right, so yeah, now I actually have to go the other way. Because that guy won't move out of my way. Hey look, it's Giovanni, what a surprise. Wahaha, welcome to my hideout. The greatest trainer. <laughs> then why aren't you the leader of the Elite Four? Oh, sick burn. Ah, oh, you're level 45 Rhyhorn, I'm so scared. Look. Oh wow, you did Earthquake because you're fast. Cool, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Uh, do I want to learn Hydro Pump? No, Surf is way better. Yes. Normally I don't even teach my Pokemon Thunder, but I just did. For Raichu, because I could. Like the ultimate, like Hydro Pump, Fire Blast, um, Solar Beam, like all those moves that miss. Like, yeah, they're technically better, but they're bad. Especially in terms of competitiveness. Like, if you run a competitive team, and you're gonna sit there and you're gonna be like, Hey... Okay, bye Giovanni. Um... Like, being completely honest with you, like... Blown away! Wow. Um, if you sit there and you like go into a competitive battle and you have Hydro Pump instead of Surf as one of your moves, I guarantee you 99% of the time I'm gonna win that battle against you because you're gonna miss with Hydro Pump because it's competitive. You don't you don't fuck around with anything other than 100% accuracy in competitive. Um, playing for funsies. Oh wow, I forgot I get to fight you again. Um, shit. Sucks, I was not prepared to fight you. I mean, it's not like I can't. So my Pokemon are still way over leveled. Yeah, let's go. You're not gonna one hit kill this. Not even close. See, that's why you don't use Thunder. Because it missed. Meanwhile, the same thing that I would have done if I just sat there and did Thunderbolt instead of Thunder multiple times, I would have had almost the same exact thing, and I wouldn't have missed. Uh, you can stay out. Could you fight? I was just careless, yo. Yeah, whatever. You fucking suck. You suck, mate. Get in my way. I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. Also, I'm gonna do something here. Bag. Let's go to the TM case. Okay, Focus Punch sucks. Calm Mind, pretty good for competitive. Roar, meh. Toxic, great and competitive. All those accuracies, poo poo, but it's good. 
Bulk up, no. Bullet seed, no. Taunt, no. Blizzard, no. You always pick Ice Beam over Blizzard. Rain Dance, pretty good. Mega Drain, one of the better grass moves. Kinda. Uh, frustration, Solar Beam, Earthquake. Who can learn Earthquake? You 100% can, because you're going to learn Earthquake. Yes. What we're gonna get rid of is we're gonna get rid of that pesky rock slide that keeps missing. And this is why every competitive team has Earthquake on it. Because Earthquake is fucking great. Um, can anybody learn Psychic? No. Cool. Didn't think so, but I wasn't counting on it. Rock Tomb is bad. 80% accuracy. Fuck that. Okay, cool. Literally nothing I can teach my Pokemon. Moving on. you even learn. Like, nothing. The Pikachu line is actually really bad. <laughs> um, I mean, for electric types, I, you know, besides having legendaries on your team, it's pretty solid, but I'm sure you can find better, like Ampharos. I know someone's gonna hate me for saying that, but... Like, there are better electric Pokemon out there besides Pikachu. Oh, that's the Boulder Badge. Go right ahead. Oh, that's the Cascade Badge. Oh, thanks. Please, go ahead. Hey, that's the old, that's the Thunder Badge. Okay, cool. Thanks. Uh, Rainbow Badge. Surf over this, because that's how that works. You got the soul badge. Congratulations. Go ahead. I didn't want to land on there. Marsh badge. Wild Pokemon. Volcano Badge. That's the Volcano Badge. Cool, go ahead. Victory Road Gate. Pokemon League. Yay, we're at Victory Road. And you know what? We're gonna step right back outside Victory Road, and we're gonna go into the bag, and we're gonna see if anybody knows Strength, because I'm pretty sure I taught somebody Strength, maybe? Who knows Strength? Oh, he does. Cool. Oh, wow. You can learn Strength, too. Hmm. Meh. Meh. Anyways. With that out of the way, we are going to call it right here, right now. This is the end of the episode. Um, we've spent 22 hours in-game, and this has been like maybe f three hours, four or five hours maybe? In actual, in actual time, because I've used this speed up button so much. I'm actually using it now to see if the time changes. Yeah, there we go. So that was a whole minute. And... Time's gonna change... Right there. Cool. Um, yeah, so that's it. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace out.